Okay, one of them is of course Burek. It is not very interesting, but I found it very interesting because I'm from Turkish and Turkey and when I come to see here, there are many Bureks in the shop, so I found it interesting. Even in Turkey, we don't, you cannot find too many Burek shops in the street. One of them is this. Second is Das Vidanya, is, I like this sentence, this means goodbye. It's good, it sounds very nice for my, my ear, so I like this. And third one is Haide, you say Haide or they say goodbye. Uh, it, it is, I think, very simple because we, in Turkish we say Haide. So we say like this also, so it is very common. So I found this one also very interesting. Yes, I have favorite Slovenian words. words. I uh, usually use lahko. <laughs> uh, then I um, use najlepša hvala in lep pozdrav. Učasih em šelesniške pustaja. Three words. I have two for sure. <laughs> the first is uh, <laughs> I thought this was like a, a town <laughs> every every stop along the way <laughs> obviously not but uh, then I also enjoy uh, Dobertek I like the idea of running uh, <laughs> when you're eating um, hmm. the third word I don't know uh, <laughs> uh, the three I learned first uh, the three Slovenian words I learned first are probably my three favorite Pivo, Kava, Vino. These were, uh, for me, <laughs> important, and I learned them very early, and uh, I still use them more than uh, I would say a lot of other words. If I could say my three favorite Slovenian words, it can be full dobro, <laughs> or mm, ena pivo prosim, <laughs> or um, Moje, no, no, how do you say? Prihajam is Chile. And in this case, I had to, yeah, in Chile we have this, in Spanish, this self. So when I say I am from Chile, Slovenians, they don't understand. And this, where? Because they are not used to, I don't know. It's, so I have to say Chile or something strong and then they will understand it. <laughs>